assalamu alaikum today topic is about renin angiotensin aldosterone system this system activate in case of shock or in case of hemorrhage uh, in case of decreased blood supply so we have a different activators for renin angiotensin aldosterone system first one is when there is decreased bp in renal artery the renal baroreceptor activated second one is and sodium chloride delivery to the macular denser cells macular denser love sodium so uh, whenever there is decreased supply of sodium in the renal artery so the macular denser senses uh, senses the decreased sodium and it will uh, pass signal to the just glomerular cells to release the renin so first so the first one uh, activator for the ras is the decreased bp by the renal baroreceptor second one is the uh, sodium chloride delivery from the macular denser cell and the third one is the sympathetic uh, tone stimulation through the beta 1 receptors beta 1 adrenal receptors so these three are uh, are the positive activators for renal re uh, release and renal release from the just glomerular cells so uh, renin when renin increase it will cause uh, it will convert the angiotensinogen into angiotensin 1 so angiotensinogen present in the liver and angiotensin uh, it will convert it into angiotensin uh, 1 by the help of renin angiotensin 1 converted into angiotensin 2 with the help of angiotensin converting enzyme angiotensin converting enzyme present in the endothelium of the uh, lungs and the kidney so it will convert into angiotensin 2 so the most common function here the most important function of the angiotensin 2 is the vasoconstriction overall the uh, arteriolar constriction it will cause the arteriolar constriction all over the body either arteries are present anywhere it will cause the vasoconstriction so ultimately when it causes the vasoconstriction it will cause the increased bp so the second function is of angiotensin 2 is the constriction of efferent arterioles so when there is decreased renal blood flow uh, it will cause angiotensin 2 will cause the uh, constriction of the efferent arterioles so it will preserve the uh, gfr function in spite of a decreased renal blood flow and the third function is the it acts on the proximal convoluted tubules of the nephron and causes the sodium hydrogen activity so sodium bicarbonate and water reabsorb permits al contraction alkalosis third one it will act on the adrenal gland and cause the release of aldosterone from zona glomerulosa and uh, the function of aldosterone is the absorption of uh, sodium and the secretions of the potassium so it will cause hypernitremia and hypokalemia and second effect it will cause the hydrogen secretions it will act on the uh, hydrogen atps activity and third and the last function of the aldo angiotensin 2 is that it will cause the act on the hypothalamus and cause thrust when there is thrust there is release of antidiuretic hormone adh from the posterior pituitary adh is also known as vasopressin the function of the adh is the absorption of the water uh, it will act on the principal cells in the collecting tubules collecting duct or collecting tubules it will cause the water reabsorption by acaporin uh, cells